Hey guys, what's up? Spectre here. There's been a lot of speculation about where the Cyberpunk sequel will be set, but some fans think they have it cracked, as there may be an in-game clue referring to the year and location of the next Cyberpunk game. Make sure to stick around for my concerns about this story as well, right after. Let's jump in. Many Cyberpunk fans think that they've been seeing a particular ad more often since the latest update of Cyberpunk 2077. Around different locations on the map, players are finding a poster that advertises a new public transportation line between Night City and Chicago. It also states that the line will be open in 2080. The ad itself reads, travel from Chicago to Night City in under three hours, worry-free, coming in 2080, courtesy of Nightcore leading many fans to believe that this is the year the game will be set and that it will take place in Chicago. According to an article over at The Gamer, this poster is not new and has been spotted several times in 2023, but many are claiming that they're seeing it more often now. Now, this is of course all speculation, as the only thing that we do know about Cyberpunk 2077 is that it's been wrapped up as of the release of Phantom Liberty, with no further DLC. And CD Projekt Red is now focused on Project Orion, the internal name for the game's sequel, and that it's in very early stages of production. A narrative director over at CDPR has already voiced his excitement for the upcoming title, tweeting, First day in the Boston office, so good to meet old friends and officially kickstart our Orion journey. I couldn't be more excited for this project, and I'm sure we can make it something special. 2077 was just a warm-up. Now, while that sounds all well and good, I do have a few worries stemming from this potential change of setting. And while many speculate that Project Orion could take place in 2080, a lot of fans have also seen the number 2079 glitching out in a recent trailer, leaving many scratching their heads, myself included. If you'd like to read more, I've left the sources down there in the description. For the sequel of Cyberpunk 2077, I wanted more depth, a more dense concentration of activities and deeper stories and relationships, not necessarily a new location. I wanted to see Night City again, but more of it. Have more alleyways and buildings built out, just more dense areas that I could explore. While not necessarily expanding the city limits themselves, or jumping to a new city entirely, I wanted to spend more time getting lost in new corners of Night City, if that makes any sense. When I think of other open world games that have come out recently, such as Starfield, they give you so much, so much of an expanse to explore, but none of it is necessarily deep and I want the complete opposite of that for Project Orion. I'd love to see new activities, and I'd like to see old ones expanded upon, along with deeper side quests and companion quests, as well as romantic relationships, as we've already seen them built upon in Phantom Liberty. And I'd love to see CDPR take that a step further with Project Orion. Another thing that I would love for Project Orion is to not be V again. And there hasn't been any sort of speculation that we'll be V again, I just wanted to throw that out there. I'd love to experience a new story, create a new character in this world. What do you think? Where would you like to go? Would you like to go to a cyberpunk version of Chicago, or would you rather stay in Night City? Or is there another, or is there another city entirely that you'd like to see? Also, what do you think about the year that the game is set in? Let me know in the comments below, and if you enjoyed this video, please do check out some of my others. I have a lot of them based on Cyberpunk 2077, so if you enjoyed this one, I think you'd enjoy one of those. It really helps out the channel, and I would honestly really appreciate it. And as always, thanks for watching, guys.